Hello everyone, my name is Anna. I'm glad to see you again on my channel. Welcome to the 2023 Washington DC Blossom Kite Festival. This annual event celebrates the blooming of the cherry blossom trees and brings together kite enthusiasts from all over. The Washington DC Blossom Kite Festival takes place every year in the beautiful National Mall. It's a free event that's open to the public and it's a great way to spend the day with family and friends. The festival has something for everyone, from kite making workshops to food vendors, live music and cultural performances. Throughout the day, there are competitions for the best kite design and the longest flight time. Participants can show off their skills and compete for prizes. It's a great way to see some amazing kite flying techniques and meet other enthusiasts. Judges walk through the crowds, admiring the creativity and skill of the kite flyers. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced kite flyer, there is something for everyone. Here in the kite flying area, visitors can watch skilled kite flyers demonstrating their aerial acrobatics. Another fun activity at the festival is the kite making workshop. Here you can learn how to make your own kite and take it home with you. Participants can explore different techniques and materials. Unfortunately, we are late and the workshop has already ended. One popular technique is using tissue paper to create vibrant and colorful designs. Simply cut out shapes and patterns from different colors of tissue paper and glue them onto your kite. Here visitors can fix their kites with the help of expert kite makers. Another popular activity is face painting. Look, there are quite a lot of people. Kids can choose from a variety of designs and have their faces transformed into colorful butterflies, superheroes or animals. One of the most exciting activities for kids at the festival is the Lego building activity. It's a great way to get creative and learn a new skill.
sorry. We're also going to launch our kite. In fact, this is my first time doing this. It turned out to be very cool, I advise everyone to try it. In addition to kite flying, the festival features a variety of cultural activities, including traditional Japanese drum performances. audience is captivated by the skill and energy of the drummers, who perform several sets throughout the day. They use traditional Japanese instruments, including the taika drums and shinobi flutes. Thank you very much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you soon, bye bye!